How's it going, everyone? This is Mitchell Mander here, and I hope you're all doing well today. I hope you're staying safe out there. I know these are uncertain times, but hopefully you guys stay safe, stay well, be healthy, and hopefully we'll all get through this. Anyways, I wanted to make a really quick video here, and as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, some unfortunate news. So the new Pokemon movie that was scheduled to come out on the 10th of July, which is titled Pokemon the Movie Coco, a movie that I was looking forward to big time, has unfortunately been postponed until further notice. It's unfortunate, but it was expected considering the Pokemon Journey series is currently on hiatus, which they ceased production on that. It's pretty clear to me that they were gonna cease production on the movie. So it was to be expected, unfortunately. And like I said, this is a movie that I'm looking forward to. I am I was a big fan of the Power of Us movie. I consider it to be one of, if not the best Pokemon movie. And since the director of that movie is working on this one, I was super excited to see how this movie would turn out. It's very, it, it has an interesting concept, but unfortunately we're gonna have to wait on that. But I'd rather wait though, considering what's going on. I'd rather them wait and give it to us later than have the voice actors, the animators, anybody involved in the studio continue to work and then someone catches the virus and potentially dies. We don't want that. We don't want any of our voice actors, our animators to catch the virus and die, potentially die. We want them to stay safe, stay healthy. So the best thing to do is just to put everything on hold and just wait until later. I know it's upsetting and I'm a little upset myself. I've been looking forward to a lot of these upcoming episodes in the Pokemon Journey series, and I'm looking forward to this movie, but I'd rather wait and keep everyone safe than have them continue working and then something tragic happens. We don't want that. So just remember that, guys. Just be patient. It'll come out when it comes out, but we'll just wait until everything's okay, A-OK -okay in Japan. So while working on the first part of this video, I actually stumbled across an article from Anime News Network regarding the emergency in Japan. Now, I know some people out there are not the biggest fans of ANN, and I do have issues with ANN myself, but this is some legitimate news here. So, on May 14th, which is tomorrow as of the upload of this video, Japan actually might be deciding whether to lift the state of emergency or not, which is a pretty big deal. Now, I'll link this article in the description below. But it looks like the Prime Minister of Japan is going to be meeting with a panel of experts, which include economists and most likely health experts, to determine whether it's safe to lift the state of emergency in Japan or not. Now, I actually watched a video by Bora B. He is a Bor Borto YouTuber. He covers the Borto anime a lot. I think you should check him out. He's a cool guy. He actually made a video the other day, which I'll have linked in the description too, which I think you should check out, where he talked about the Borto anime potentially returning. And he mentioned in his video that cases have actually dropped in Japan since April. Significantly so. And that's one of the reasons why the state of emergency may potentially be lifted. Because the cases are down. Which is great news. That's fantastic. That's something we all want. Which means that we could see the, the production of the Pokemon series and other animes out there resuming. That's great news. And we all want that. However, don't get your hopes up just yet. Not only may the state of emergency not get lifted tomorrow, but we also got to consider the fact that we don't want uh, another wave of cases or another surge of cases to happen in another month. We don't want the series to come back and then we have another surge of cases and then it goes right back on hiatus. So hopefully they take that into consideration. Additionally, since the series has been basically on hiatus for a couple weeks now, it's, I believe they ceased production roughly a month ago at this point, as of May 13th. It's been about a month since production has ceased on the Pokemon anime. So if they resume production, the, the episodes aren't going to come up just like that. It might be, I'd say, like if the state of emergency lifts and they go right back to work, let's say, next week, I'd say expect episodes to come back maybe at the earliest late June. Maybe early July. I might be off. I know in Bar B's video he mentioned maybe around June 13th for Boruto to return. But I think that may be slightly a bit optimistic. If the state of emergency lifts and the production resumes next week, I'm guessing maybe late June would be the earliest the series could come back. But I don't know. 
I just don't want another surge of cases and then Japan's right back to where it was before. I just hope everyone stays safe and hopefully they make a smart decision with this state of emergency either being lifted or not. So that's all I got for this video. So guys out there, let's actually keep this, uh, the comment section on this video positive. No negativity. Let's try to talk as little as possible about this dang virus and all the horrible things it's done. Let's just spread positivity out there. So guys out there in the comment section down below, let me know your thoughts on the new Pokemon movie. Are you excited for it? I'm excited for it. I love The Power of Us. That was a great movie. And with the person directing that movie, directing this one, I'm super excited for it. So let me know your thoughts. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. And remember, stay safe out there.